Victor, on the back of what was a very long week in Dubai, how are you feeling after two weeks back to back? Yeah, three actually with the Hero Cup before. So I was thinking, you know, um, obviously it wasn't the Sunday I was expecting uh, yesterday or the Monday, I guess, the final round. But it's all part of the learning, I guess, after the win. Um, and I kind of like almost forgot that we played the Hero Cup, which was obviously a lot of energy out as well uh, with the event. Um, so, yeah, today's going to be an off day and uh, just checking in, getting the clubs ready and then back at it for the program tomorrow. I believe you have some fond memories of this place as well from your Challenge Tour days. Do, do you reminisce on what it was like then? Yeah, I was saying like when I walked into the clubhouse, um, it's the first time I've been here since 2017, 2018, yeah, 2018. Um, graduating, I just remember being here on the 18th green and you know I was so close and Audrey holding a nice putt on the last to win the tournament and then obviously JB getting the uh, challenge through number one graduate but yeah it's such a fun memory to, to come back here for sure. Can you refresh our minds on the course obviously we've got no rain forecasted thank god this week so it should be blue skies. Yeah I think the course uh, from what I've heard is, is a little bit tougher than it was last year I think uh, they're going to try to control the scoring I think there's a bit more rough around some of the greens and it should keep the scoring a bit a bit down relative to um, what Nikolai shot last year with, I think, a gazillion birdies and some eagles and 24 under par winning score. Uh, Victor, welcome back to Raz Al Khaima on the back of three weeks. Uh, you must be feeling it a little bit at the moment. How how is it after the Hero Dubai Desert Classic? Well, yeah, forcément, un dimanche qui n'était pas le dimanche que j'espérais, mais uh, après voilà trois très belles semaines uh, dans l'ensemble, c'est toujours un plaisir de revenir ici uh, sur un parcours avec. Uh, de très bons souvenirs, la finale du, du Challenge Tour en 2018 et voilà un parcours sur lequel j'avais fini deuxième donc j'espère faire une place, une place de mieux cette semaine. Refresh our memory if you would a little bit about the course, obviously we're, we're going to have blue skies so we shouldn't have anything adverse weather-wise. Non, je pense que voilà le parcours est un petit peu plus difficile de, que l'année dernière je pense, j'ai parlé à quelques joueurs, ils m'ont dit qu'il y avait un petit peu plus de rough euh, comparé à, à l'année dernière où ça s'était gagné en moins 24 avec Nicolas qui avait fait forcément un super tournoi. Donc je pense que, que oui, il le, le, y a un peu plus de rap, peut-être les greens un petit peu plus fermes, il y a toujours du vent ici, on est quand même en, en bord de mer, donc euh, voilà, peut-être que le scoring sera un petit peu, un petit peu plus difficile, on, on verra comment la semaine se passe.